Okay, let's talk about the Z batteries. Uh, these ones are 6,000 milliamp hour. This is a two cell hard case LiPo battery. As you can see, I have a bunch of different Z batteries. I use them in pretty much all of my trucks. Um, I have some three cell batteries. I have a bunch of different two cell batteries. These are pretty much all I use in my crawlers. Um, I don't do any like competition or anything like that. I just go out in the woods with some friends and have some fun. So um, I love these batteries. They're great. Um, the runtime that I get is is really significant in my opinion. Um, they they don't really fade uh, throughout their run. They they hold a pretty good charge through through the entire uh, charge, and then they obviously hit a uh, light bulb cut off on the truck, and that's when you see the reduction in performance. But overall runtime is really good on a crawler. I can get you know 40 minutes to an hour. Um, on these uh, 6,000 milliamp hour batteries. I do have some 5,200 uh, 5, milliamp hour as well as 7,200 milliamp hour batteries. And uh, I, I, I really love all of them. Um, I think that they're great. I also run these in short course trucks. I have a mini uh, Revo that I run Z batteries in. As long as you're following proper charging and runtime, you know, make sure you are using low voltage cutoff when you're running a LiPo battery. Make sure your truck or car has that and make sure it's enabled and follow proper charging procedures. I always charge my batteries at one amp. Um, so a 6,000 milliamp battery will get charged at six amps. My crawlers typically see mud and snow and water and creeks and that kind of thing. And these always hold up. Um, I cannot recommend these enough.